with no matches to DNA samples, no video or no one witnessing the crime. The story of what happened to David Moreau is a mystery, one the family wants answers to. It was off this road where 53-year-old David Moreau was last seen, walking home from the bars minus all the snow. He had gone that July 18th day back in 2004 to win some money playing Shake a Day at Sarge's Bar. Jokingly told him, you know, if you win any money, share it with me, which we all joked with each other all the time. It was a family reunion that weekend. He was not seen again then until his body was discovered at 6 o'clock. Moreau was found here laying face down in front of his mother's place, murdered. And police say there was no sign of a struggle. He'd been struck in the head uh, very hard with something that caused a skull fracture and death. But this here was the dumpster that supposedly, I know it was moved, like it was hiding him. With no concrete evidence yet to link the crime to a suspect. That's my brother. Moreau's sister, Roseanne, still waits in shock. I can not believe it. I still have a hard time. Sorry. I still have a hard time with it because I don't understand why they brought him to Mother's. Do you feel like David had any enemies? No. I really don't. I never, ever seen my brother argue with anybody. Ever. Not even us. We even tried to get him mad to argue with us, and he wouldn't do it. Moreau's wallet nowhere to be found, but police did find proof that someone else tampered with him. That the DNA samples that we have from the person and clothing of Mr. Moreau are not his DNA samples. So we do have a suspect out there. Those who first handled the investigation are still working the case, interviewing hundreds of people, but have exhausted all leads. An unsolved homicide is never closed. And it's never far from our mind. But I, I, I like this one. I, I do. I like this one. All Roseanne and her siblings have left of their brother are pictures and memories. But I always told him I loved him. I, I, to, I tell him all my family that because you never know. You never know. Moreau had two sons as well. The family says the hardest holiday to spend without David is Thanksgiving, where they all come together. The family is offering a $5,000 reward to anyone who can bring information that would lead to an arrest and conviction. Again, if you or someone you know have any information about this cold case, contact the McCook Police Department to get this nearly 12-year-old case solved.